Hello Tamers, and welcome back to the digital world of Digimobs. As always, I'm Raviel Polyferidius, the vampiric last member of Dark Aetherius. So, today we're going to go exploring. I know usually I try to keep going with... Is he getting hurt by a cactus? Hold on. What are you getting hurt by? You're a vendor. You shouldn't be getting hurt. Stop that. You should not be getting hurt. Um, now, usually... Last time we got all the way back here to the ultimate village. And we went a little past it. Well, I say we keep going south. Because... I am actually going to keep that cacti, so we can make a cacti farm back at, um... Uh, actually, we might set up a base here eventually, so I may wait off on that and make a cacti farm here. But, yeah, we're going to continue forward, going south. The main reason is there are many unexplored lands. Why not? Why not head out and continue exploring for new Digimon? New lands, new parts of this ever-expanding digital world. And yes, if you noticed, Traveler's Backpack is still currently in its previous version. I really don't want to have to upgrade, update to the upgrades yet. Main reason. Uh, while we are walking towards what we've already, through what we've already seen, I'll do uh, a news update. So, mainly for the videos on the channel, Digimobs will still be going, Kingdom Hearts is still going on track right now, and Digi, uh, Digimon Story Lost Evolution will be coming to its end soon. Not too soon, but soon. If you haven't gone over and watched that, I highly suggest it. It's been a blast to play so far. Hi, Rosemon. And then, beyond that, uh, this past Saturday, I actually did go back. I did decide to stream over on Twitch. Streamed for five and a half hours of a Ocarina of Time Majora's Mask randomizer. And got pretty far. I would say next time I start streaming, which may be later this week, I'm not sure. I would suggest uh, coming on over and... Checking out the stream. Maybe though, maybe some people that know Majora's Mask better than I do could uh, enlighten me on some stuff. Um, other thing, I now have a capture card. This capture card will allow me to record PS4, record and stream PS4 and Switch games currently, as those are the only two consoles I have that can go into it. 
It's not the best capture card out there, but it's good enough for just starting. So I hope you got I hope everyone looks forward to videos on the Switch, videos on PS4. And yes, I keep saying PS4, not PS5. I don't have a PS5. So, that that is one thing. And of course, there will be more. Actually, thinking about it, the day this comes out after I get home from work, I may decide to stream. A new game's coming out uh, this Thursday, which has a three-day pre-window. Now, of course, other people will more than likely be streaming this game, but... I mean, what says I can't do? Uh, to give context, it is Payday 3. You guys have seen my Payday 2s whenever I do holiday stuff. I will still bring up Payday 2 if they don't have holiday su holiday missions come certain holidays. But hope they are working on, from what I've seen, they're working on new characters, bringing old characters into the new game, and the first year of DLC, at least right now. So we have that coming up. And ooh, icebergs. If only I had a silk touch pick. I've got an unbreaking efficiency pick, which I want to make into a fortune pickaxe. You get the fortune first, then you get the efficiency. Or the silk touch. You get the fortune first, then the silk touch. What is this? It's just a landmass of rocky stone? Huh. Oh! I have Plesiomon! Uh, wait, do I have Plesiomon in my... Hold on. D-terminal. <laughs> yep, yep, I do. Oh, I just noticed the D-terminal has a, uh... Sound like a book. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, and in news related to Minecraft, uh, I don't know if I'll show it off at some point. Uh, the Aether mod just updated. Yeah, the original Aether mod from back, uh, I think, 1.12.2 has finally updated. It's updated to, I believe they said 1.19.2. And 1.20.1. I believe that's what they said over on their Discord. And, uh, yeah, that's, uh... I believe they said once they finalize everything with it, they'll be working on Aether 2 coming forward as well. So, unfortunately, what that means for the Digimon... The Digimob's digital world is that... We won't be seeing the Aether anytime soon. Which is sad, but it's understandable. Hmm. This digital world is expansive and amazing to look at but sometimes it just feels lonely So far, though, we found quite a bit. 
and we really don't have to worry about coordinates anymore as long as we have the map. The problem becomes if we uh, broke out here without coordinates on. That's why I'm continually, unless we fall into a ravine or something, it won't be from mobs. Let's go ahead and we'll keep the D terminal out, but we'll put the D3 away. I haven't seen any Digimobs in a while. Any Digimon. It's just a... Red leaves. And we are creeping towards 250 subscribers, everyone. So I'm hoping everyone can still give me suggestions in the comments of the videos. Any of the videos, it doesn't matter which video it is. Please give me suggestions of what to do. Because I'm going to put up a poll of the various suggestions. And I'll run through them. I think there was one that's already, I think there's one that it's already, I think it already came to fruition, but there's also a side quest that goes with it that is, it's not, I don't think it's worthy of a, like they said, for 250, a two and a half hour special. That's what they were thinking. I've also been thinking of expanding the Minecraft repertoire of anime game, anime mods up a bit and have uh, various series running simultaneously, but offshooting them to every other week, maybe. So, Digimobs one week, then maybe do a series with... Uh, Demon Slayer mod, or do a series with uh, the One Piece Mind Mind No Me mod. A Pokemon. That's a drowned. But there is a chest in there that I want. Two drowned. I believe there's a chest in that as well, but we'll also keep the building blocks. As it's rare, you can get chiseled stone. Yeah, what if, from what I remember, I believe there's one down in here somewhere. I just don't remember where. Yeah. 
Oh, wow, there is a lot of these guys showing up. There we go. More wheat, a luck of the sea, and kelp that I don't like. Wait, was that a new... That's Marine Angemon. I've seen Marine Angemon recently. That's how I know it's that. Marine Angemon is uh, one of the favored Digimon of... Or one of the Digimon that gets a its Mega into Digimon Survive. Hey, Marine Angemon. Oh, I've already grabbed you. Oh, getting up close, you are frightening. <laughs> Oh, there's a gold block there. We can get that. Oh. Don't have my pickaxe out. But, yeah. I know a lot of this is just travel going south more, but honestly, this gives more time to just appreciate the beauty of the world. Wouldn't you agree? I mean, look, we found the same kind of trees that the original Digi Village is at, and beside a jungle, no less. It's really a beautiful world. But yeah, I'd love to hear... Going back to the anime... Uh, potential other animes. If you guys would love to see that, uh, just drop a thing down and tell me. I'll make up some mod packs. I'd love to see what you guys have, because My Hero, One Piece, uh, I think there's a Jujutsu Kaisen mod pack, I don't know much about Jujutsu Kaisen, so that would be uh, me fumbling a lot. <laughs> uh, I think there is a Bleach, one or two Bleach mod packs, or Bleach mods, but I don't think they're fully complete yet. Or if they are complete, they're not as complete as the Demon Slayer mod pack. But yeah. I'll, if you guys suggest something, I will look at it. Sincerely. And I'll either get back to you with a response of why I can't, or I will do it. Um... I will say the God of High School mod is a no-go, because I think the creator still never made crafting rest. I, I, I haven't seen any... I haven't gone to check and see if there's any updates on it. I'd have to go check to see if God of High School has any updates. And if it does... I'd have to check to see if any of the items are... Craftable. Is there, it says there's a village here. Because that's the sign of a village right there. Let's see. That's a village's pathway. We found a small village. There's at least one villager. Ebony Log. 
Do I have another axe? Is it? Nope. I'm fine if I can't chop the whole thing down. I do wish I could get a sapling or two. The way the sapling looks, it looks like a, uh, oh boy. It looks like dark oak, so it might act like dark oak. Dark oak needs to have four in a, um, in a two by two. It's also getting night, so we'll, uh, bunk down right here beside this villager. Good thing we have a sleeping bag. <laughs> Open the door. All right, is this an ebony log over here? Yeah. Perfect. Just enough that we can make one tree and then maybe go further from there. But incredible that this village is just... Ow. Hey, where'd you get a sapling at? No fair. I'm going to have to leave this floating until I can get a, get either an axe that can deal with that or something. Oh, where is the rest of the village? It, wait a minute, is that... When I was looking through the crafting matrix, that's... That's a waystone. Incredible. Also, more of the various brick types. I'll leave that. I will take that, though. Don't get to go into the nether too often. I will keep the waystone on me, though. Incredible. So villages in areas we've un not yet discovered can have waystones. There are mega level vendors. Smooth stone path. Oh, pigs. This must be a uh, yeah, smoker shop. Uh... Mm. So where are those vendors at? So that's a basic vendor right there. But he's a high Andromon. War Greymon. High Andromon. You're an armor vendor. You're just a basic vendor, but... All right, give me my D3. All right, let's see what you got for sale. DVD players, cyber parts, the Digimental of Friendship, a DVD game, brown data, Digicamera, Moon Mirror, and the Digimental of Destiny. Wow, you're the only two vendors I see around this village. But this village is small. So maybe it just needs to expand more. I mean, I do see a lot of Rosemon around here. That's incredible. How how are they spawning near the village? Unless some of the village is just close enough to this little bit of plains. To that little bit of the world that it's... 
because for full context, the ebony, yeah, as we've seen, the ebony logs is from oh the biomes you'll go. Uh, this biome should not have digi mobs. It shouldn't. But I think that plains biome is just close enough that uh, life uh, finds a way. Well, this forest, this forest does make me really think of a dark oak uh, forest now. What is this, horseweed? Ew. Yeah, it very much makes me think of a, a roof, as they keep calling it, a roofed forest. It's a dark oak forest. What in the pity pat whack? Are these just, is that wheat? It looks like wheat. Prairie grass. So this is a prairie. Oh, tall prairie grass. There's a horse. There's another village up ahead. We found one mega village. Maybe we'll find another. There's... Po and I will say, there is potential of all kinds of things we've missed by just walking in a certain direction. I was right. Every village unseen has a waystone. Hmm. Well, for a while at least, we're going to be collecting waystones. As. Okay, I was about to say, where did my... There they are. I'm getting a little bit of XP points back on the pickaxe. As since I don't have much in the way of an XP farm yet. Except for just Digimobs in general. Having a little bit of extra does never hurts. Where? I was about to say, where did you come from? Wheat is always good, but we do have it in overabundance. There we go. And that's also a little bit of extra. I'll leave that one alive. But it gives a little bit of extra food in case we start running out of potatoes eventually. Oh, a blacksmith. We'll take his. this. these. Oh, definitely taking those diamonds. The obsidian, the gold ingots, and the iron pickaxe, because we can use... Now we can just use the iron pickaxe for a while. Good back to good, good old reliable iron.
Man, a lot of cows out this way. But the more cows I slay, the more backpacks I can make. Right now we're already up to another backpack. And of course, the world beyond is interesting, but I think we'll head back to this village and call it there. We can shack up with the blacksmith now that we know he's not going to be, well, at the former blacksmith's place, now that we know he's not going to be there. Oh, we can also take his lava. I didn't even think about that. Let me go ahead and just, uh, scoop, scoop. And just deposit the lava. There we go. Oh, we'll also take the chest. Why not? Uh, oh, yeah, we'll take the iron leggings. I didn't even think about upgrading my current pair. And we'll take a little bit of excess bread. Why not? So, that is where we will... That is where we will call it, everyone. Thank you, everyone, so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you all in the next video. Stay digital, y'all.